I love the any props having to do with anyone other than the quarterbacks throwing. <laughs> I just enjoy those. It's it's like my favorite bet every year. Yeah. I think in the Super Bowl you just see it all the time. I mean, even the last I would think with these two teams especially. So that's it's something we've seen in the past. So there's I'm going a little differently. I and Sam was talking about this. There's just no value left on like over two and a half pass throwers. So I've got non quarterback touchdown pass twenty two to one at DraftKings. Okay. I like it. I tra- Travis Kelsey is the guy I look at. He had a touchdown pass last season or the year before in the playoffs. He has four career pass attempts. They like to run that little like pop pass at the goal line. I think there's a chance there. Um, did we have a touchdown pass last year by a position player? Was it not? Um, or was that two years ago? Maybe there's a ball into the end zone. We had this conversation in the yeah. office. It was some, I forget. So I just think there's there's a chance to have that happen by a similar, you know, in a similar boat I have or not have, but I saw any player to have a completion, a reception and a rush is nine to one. That also brings the quarterbacks into the mix, obviously. Um, so I'd like to find like a, an alternate line and have over three and a half guys throw a pass. That'd be sick. Two on each side. You know, I think both teams could have a little wrinkle. It's possible. I would, I will say though, the, and I mean, this doesn't mean it won't happen. The, um, uh, the Eagles did not have anyone other than Jalen Hurts and Gardner Minshew throw a pass this year. But that could mean they're just holding it for the Super Bowl. <laughs>